Holy crap. This random booster is way better than I thought it would be. So. Basically, yeah, this is the random booster volume uh, 15. Volume 15. Is it? Yes, yeah, volume 15. This is, I'm, first of all, I'm going to give credit to Sangi for this image. Because it's where I found it from. Basically, I did do have this loaded on YouTube, and basically, it's in full screen. So, yeah, basically, I just want to go over to some stuff. So, yeah, so let's get off the way. Orbegus, which I think right away will be good. Zero turn, which is good. Quick, which, quick dash, which we'll get into. Which we have twice leopard, not that great. One dash, sorry. Proof, okay. Operate, and then uh, you ruined it. <laughs> so, these two are already good because you have zero turn, which is good for attack from my personal experience. Qu Qu quick dash, which we'll get into. And then twice leopard is one dash, which is good, and proof, which is great. Next up, we have Buster Excalibur in this royal, like, holy color. Like, it's literally white. It's like, holy. It's literally holy. With Zenith Absorb. So, it already comes with good parts. Like, Buster Excalibur is fairly good from what I hear. Zenith. I hear that you, I, from what I heard on, like, the wiki, eat Zenith. If it's like the, it's like the, the only disc Chosy Valkyrie can use. As well, because let me just fix something. From over here, it's only like it shows you Valkyrie from just with the Zenith disc, which because it is pretty like heavier than the Zero disc, but not by that much. But okay, basically, here we have Dead Hades, which it's all which is good enough. Of but then, which is from my, from my experience, comparatively good. Well, also, but it comes with a dash. A, a dash expand and extreme dash. Dead Hades with extreme dash. So you already imagine if you get Orbegus on Dead Hades. You have you can make one overpower combo like Dead Hades. Dead Hades zero turn extreme dash. Or even like double O bump, which I'm surprised they didn't put it in here, but at the same time, not. Anyway, we're going to got Tinko Beyblades. We have Bushin, Dragon, Retsu, Seven Friction. Seven's a good part. Dodo and the got Tinko parts useful, and the friction is all right. All right, so then we have Slash Ashura, five quest. Now this is another way to get five. Oh yeah, it's by the way, the is San on the. Wait, strip and quest. It's another way to get quest, so yeah, alright. Then you have this one, which is the remake of Storm Freaking Pegasus, which was my first ever Beyblade, I kid you not. It's 10 Glaive Qu Quick Dash. Now, quick is basically just extreme, but made into shape to look like one of Vive RF, so yeah. And here's the price Beyblade, which is Cosmo Valkyrie, which I'm going which I think won't be appearing in anime because. It's a Valkyrie Beyblade because you already got a Valkyrie Beyblade slash Valkyrie. And it's Constable Valkyrie 11 Eternal 10. So it comes with the 10 weight. So so you can just make Bushin Assurer's Lair with it if you get these three. Like, because Bushin Assurer is Bushin Assurer 10. So this comes with 10 Bushin Assurer. You can make this really weird recolor of Bushin Assurer. Cosmo Valkyrie, I think the outer disc, the outer layer would be good for life after that from what I've seen on the box. It also comes with 11 Eternal. So if this thing is not canon, you don't really technically have to keep in your collection. So if, so if this thing turns out not to be canon at all, that'd be great. Because we could just go, hey, hey can I have your Eternal for a second? Which would be good. I mean, Cosmo, so Cosmo seems like it's going to be a really OP part. Well, technically OP. So, let me, I'm going to talk about the combos you can make from this. Now, I'm going to, now, I'm going to try, ex going to exclude these two because, yeah. Uh, because, why wouldn't you, why would you want to take them apart? So, basically, you can imagine it. It, it is, you can make Dead Hades, zero turn, extreme dash, if you just get two. And I hear Slash is a good 
part. So you can make like, so imagine if you get Zenith with it, like slash, ash, slash whatever, with whatever weight, Zenith Extreme Dash. But just imagine, sorry for the lag there. So basically, yeah, I'll also talk about it further with the next thing that's coming up. So this is the new Fafnir Beyblade that's coming out, it's Wizard Fafnir. It's, so basically, this is going to be less spinning Beyblade, which from what, I, from what I heard Sankey talk about, you can only keep these two parts right here, the Gatinko Tip and the Wizard Base, are only compatible with each other. And that makes sense to me, because after all, from, what, from my experience, and it's like if you take the Katingo chip chip off, you can still like put them on. So really, the thing kind of depends on what base you, you use. And and even then, you ha you can't really go. Oh hey, let's just go on because guess because the Katingo chip has like the thing that allows you to launch it into it. So basically, the making making it so that Fafnir and Wizard can't be taken apart onto other Beyblades makes sense. You know it's customization, yes, but but totally just makes this immense makes sense because if it didn't, it would just kind of ruin the Beyblade if it tried to make it fit to other Beyblades. So basically, yeah, and I hope the blue thing is rubber. I hope it is because it makes sense for Fafnir to have rubber. So basically, Wizard Fafnir Sen Ratchet, which it's supposed to be free spinning disc that only spins to the left, so I'm wondering how that's gonna work. And rise, which from what I see is kind of guard combine guard, which is kind. Of, I think it's gonna be like guard, but only for stamina. And I think it's free spinning as well. So yeah, of course it's a stamina type, and I can't wait to see if this is competitive or not because after all, a lot of rubber. I think it even has more rubber than Geist fast. <laughs> Which, which, this kind of reminds me a bit of the way the rubber's on there. Kind of reminds me of Mathkill or Drago. Let me try to see if I have it. Yeah, it reminds me of this Beyblade. Like, this is the first Beyblade that, that officially had spin stealing on it because it has rubber. Like, in the Malphite series, the spinning stealing was not as effective because it's climbing against metal, so it's like... Three spinning while it's getting a big impact of it, it was like kind of like draw, drawing a lot. While with this one, it's obviously going to like outspin Beyblades. So, yeah. Oh, by the way, I want so, yeah, that's it really. So, yeah, babe, but before I go, I want to give a little preview for little videos I'm doing. For videos I'm going to do in the future, and it's basically unbox videos. So, basically, the Beyblade unbox videos I'll be doing is the Master Kit set, which is the Excalia String Launcher set. Tyros T2, Tyros T2 and Doom Slasher D2 Toon Pack. Ace Dragon Sting Charge. Red, no. Ace Dragon Sting Charge. Zan, which also comes with its Rock and Grand. Random Booster Volume 14, Korean version. Claw Tiger Zero Extend. Random Lair Collection Volume 10, Orp Aegis. And Hajim. May Sancho's Chosy Valkyrie One Dash Reach Reboot Dash. So yeah, that's gonna be it for this video. If there, I don't think I'm gonna put any editing in it. I just wanna like give you just quick news, like as well as leaks for like the leaks for the new Beyblades, as well as like upcoming videos I'll be doing. And I think the Master Kit set comes next week, and each second should come like during during like the during like tomorrow during probably comes like tomorrow or like during tomorrow. Or this week, and or week it should come like next week as well, and like Tyrus T4 and Dim Size D2 2 back should also come like next week or two. And how to be sent shows Chosy Valkyrie would will come in like I think May, in like the 14th of May at least. So yeah, and guys, if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to hit that thumbs like button. If you want to see more, make sure to subscribe to the notification bell. And as always, be more to be here. Signing out.